decided to withdraw that charge. A ruling, a ruling is being expected this morning before the Federal High Court in Lagos in respect of that uh, application to withdraw that charge. Now they brought another charge before the SCT High Court, a 20-count charge against the same person, against the same uh, embattled governor of the Central Bank, uh, and one other person. Now, the matter was meant for arraignment this morning, but two things played out which clearly showed that the complainant itself was not ready for the arraignment. The second defendant was not made available. The second defendant was not in court. And it is right that all the defendants in a charge must be present to take their plea. And consequently, the complainant on its own requested for an adjournment for the arraignment to be done at a later date. And so we didn't oppose that application. The arraignment will now come up on Wednesday, 20, 23rd of, of this month, Wednesday 23rd. That's exactly what happened. Did you say that the, the prosecution was not ready for the case? What? Did you say that the prosecution all the defendants was not ready? Were not available yes, court. all the defendants were not available in court, in court this morning. And as a consequence, the arraignment couldn't go on. But yes. ready to defend your client. Of course, that's why we are here. We are ready. Don't forget that his presumption of innocence stands until any pronouncement is made by the court of law. He's presumed innocent. We are ready. 
whenever we are called upon, we'll be there for him. Yeah. We understand that there are 20 charges. Uh, can you tell us some of those charges? Unfortunately, we are yet to see those charges. We are, served, we are, we've been served, but we are, we are yet to read it. We, we was, our client was served late last night, and you'll agree with us that there's no way between last night and this morning that uh, we will have digested the, the, the charge. So we'll go, uh, we'll go through it and give the appropriate advice to our clients. Yes, thank you so much. ATK in the SAN. A means Akinolu, T means Timothy. Kehinde, that is the brother of Taiwo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and they are very strong. Twins. Our twins are my All right, sir. Troops will continue to respond with overwhelming military force. against any group that threatens the safety of citizens and troops alike. The men and women of the military will continue to put themselves in arms way time and time again in order to protect our great nation. In the first instance, troops, while conducting offensive operation, entered into an ambush in Kudu general area in Chiruru local government area of Niger State. And then the ambush and the firefight resulted in the death of three officers, 22 soldiers, while seven were wounded in action.